Over the last several years, there's been a lot of innovation when it comes to technology with how we communicate. Now, one of the problems as people have started coming back to the office is background noise. Specifically, if you live in Cubeville, oftentimes your neighbor's voice is getting picked up onto those calls. Now, there's a lot of different solutions to help with this, noise canceling headphones, etc. But I've tried a couple out and one of the software I have found to work best is a tool called crisp.ai. And one of the reasons I like crisp is it actually samples your voice to determine your, how your voice is different than your neighbor's voice. Now up next, I'm gonna show you a quick demonstration of how crisp works and what it sounds like. Now I'm gonna show you the power of crisp. And to do this, we've set up a little experiment. So for fun, I just put the audio visualization of crisp in yellow and just the regular microphone in red. Now down here, you can see I've got my microphone and I've got my iPhone. And I had my wife record some corporate speak so you could see what it might be like for two different people to be speaking at the same time. So I'm gonna play her speaking and I talking at the same time. And then I'm gonna turn on crisp so you can see what it sounds like when crisp filters out someone else's voice. So, all right, here we go. So together we're both talking at the same time. It's not great. We're trying to think outside and the box now here. I'm so I thought your ideas would have been added to that file, Chris. and I was hoping. Now, hopefully, her voice has been drowned out, and you can't hear her at all, and you can only hear my voice speaking. But if I turn off Chris, copier, I think I might have left a copy of the document on the copier. Uh, so it's really hard to hear both I can go to the copier. Oh, wait a second. My phone is ringing. Hold on. I got to pick this up. It's about a contract. You're going to stop her playing. I know. Oh, this is definitely. So there's an example of how crisp can be used. I don't think it's perfect if there's um, like a movie or something playing or lots of music. It doesn't cut that out, but it's really good at cutting out voices in a typical corporate office setting. If you found this video helpful, or if you found another way to reduce noise in your office, leave a comment down below. Or if you have another video idea you'd like to see me try out, I'd be more than happy to do so. Thanks, have a great day.